probably uh, Super Ted, because uh, I have the best mate like Penfold, I reckon. We were going down well. Um, I reckon at the moment it's probably a uh, steak from Gauchos. Get a little plug in there. I think I would probably be, I'd like to think I'd be a football player. Uh, I, at 15, had to make some big decisions whether I was going to go rugby or football, and I uh, chose rugby. And uh, I'd like to think if I went the other way, I'd be a football player. Uh, most memorable would be uh, when I was 18 playing at Roslyn Park in the National School Sevens and we uh, beat a very strong Colston side which might have contained uh, Tom Vandell, uh, Shane Geraghty and a few others. I would say Cape Town is probably the nicest place, a I've, I've, I've place I've really enjoyed, just one of the bays just off the side of Cape Town, a place called Hout Bay. Um, I'd like, I'm going to sound a bit gangster here, but I, um, I like Lil Wayne, Drake, um, Kanye West, those amongst others. Ideally, um, uh, probably out for a couple of drinks with a few friends and uh, just see where the night takes us. Um, oh, this is going to sound a bit corny, but I'd like to skydive and I'd like to do it somewhere uh, pretty extraordinary, maybe somewhere like New Zealand. Uh, this is a tricky one. Um, I'm going to go with, it's out of two probably, one Dumb and Dumber, which I absolutely love. Um, and the other one would be a classic, uh, Life of Brian, um, which I just, I just find hilarious. Um, it'd have to be The Office, uh, well, The Office until I just sat down and basically watched nearly all of the Entourage. So I'm going Entourage. Um, I'm not going to say more wishes. Um, I'm going to say happiness for the rest of my life. Um, superpower would be invisibility, and uh, well, I'm not going to tell you what I'll do with it. Um, I think maybe something quite relaxed, something that I get to uh, play golf. Well, maybe just a golf, a professional golf player. I can play golf all day. Um, most expensive uh, would probably be I got some jewellery for an ex-girlfriend um, and you know, I asked her for the money back but she wouldn't give it to me. Uh, treasure possession would be a hip flask that my grandfather gave me just before he passed away uh, and then had it engraved with uh, quote, a, a quote, something you always used to say and uh, still got that with me and it means, uh, means a great deal.